What's going on Spartans? Welcome back. I'm King. If you haven't seen pictures of me or videos of me before, ta-da, face cam reveal. Anyway, so as you know, I have two channels, King24412, which is my 25k multi-gaming channel, and of course, the Clash Army, which is my main channel for Clash of Clans. So, what I want to do is do a 25k and 55k Q&A video for you guys. Been a few days since I've been at that level, and I've uh, been pretty excited to get here. I'm really honored. Thanks so much for being fans. And let's start out with the first questions that I had. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to pull them up on my phone real quick. I know the first question was something like, how old are you? There we go. Number one question, how old are you? I am 22 years old. I'll be 23 in a few months here in July. Uh, beginning of July, July 3rd, I'll actually be 23. Pretty cool. And then uh, what jobs do you do besides YouTube? Well, as you guys know, I do YouTube. I have three channels. I also do a, I work at a company downtown Chicago. I'm not going to say the name because we know people that will call <laughs> and that's not going to happen. Uh, basically, I do marketing, advertising, sales. And yeah, so that's pretty much what I do. And uh, let's see here. Next question. Hold on here. Hold on. I know I got more in here. Uh, what did you do in your first ever YouTube video? Wow. Good question. What did I do in my first ever YouTube video? Hmm. Well, I believe my first ever YouTube video actually was a YouTube All-Stars video. I might be wrong on that, but for my King2412 channel, I'm pretty positive that was the first video ever. Um, yeah, actually, I'm pretty positive. Let me actually see what the first video was for my Clash Army channel. I just got to load it up. I'm just pulling it all the way down here, just sliding through my video list. That's a really crazy question. Uh, another question I had was, do you have a girlfriend? I'm currently single. Uh, yeah, uh, but I did have a girlfriend before. She's obviously my ex now, <laughs> which is completely fine. Trust me. And let's see what else were the qu okay first first video I ever did on the Clash Army was Epic Raids. All right, it, uh, number Epic Raids number six, three million in three raids. Nice. That was the first one I ever did. And Madden Divinix first one on the channel was Hog Rider stealing loot. And uh, yeah, so that was pretty much the beginning of Clash Army right there. And let's see, what other questions should we answer today? Hmm. All right, so we're back. I know another question that someone asked me. I don't know how they knew this, that I started a new job. I guess I've said it in a video or something. But I got asked, how hard is it to do a full-time job 50 hours a week uh, plus do YouTube? And let me tell you, it is insanity. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do it, honestly. I will figure it out, though. I can promise you that. This will not affect my YouTube ability. I will definitely keep pumping videos out. I just need a couple days to figure that out, guys, so bear with me on that. Also, what are the goals for the future of my YouTube channel? All right, so really actually something I want to talk about. It's really cool. I want to keep pushing the Clash Army as much as possible, collaborating, growing it, getting it to 100K and above. That's my main goal this year is to get 100K subs on one of my channels, most likely the Clash Army. I want to go ahead and make my World, <laughs> make my world Zombination channel, guys. Uh, which is World Zombination Expert. I want to make that grow to as big as possible, basically make it the number one World Zombination channel, which is really exciting. I have the backing of Proletariat, the creators of the game, so I'm pretty excited about that. And then my King 20412 channel is just going to be a lot of fun, man. It's going to be a lot of me going on there, playing video games, just any kind of game I want whenever I have time to, and then posting. So I'm really excited about being able to have a multi-gaming channel 100%. And also having a complete class channel and a complete world domination channel. It's a lot of work, but it's something I think will be really awesome as we grow. And I hope you guys are as excited as I am. I know the future has got a lot of cool things that I'm going to be doing in it. And uh, I'm going to be going skydiving. I might do some indoor skydiving too for fun with some friends and record it. I might get some girls involved. Who knows? We might just get some girls on just because it'd be, I know you guys love seeing girls. And why not, right? All right, so... <laughs> Other than that, uh, I want to collaborate more with my friends, like Tiff Tiff. I want to get her more involved in YouTube and put her on this channel. Hopefully, you guys like her because she's my best friend, and it's just a lot of fun working with people in real life, and I want to do more interactive things with my fans, more Skype calls, post those Skype calls to my YouTube. I want to start doing more giveaways. I also want to continue to, I guess, create new content that people haven't decided to do. I might, okay, a lot of people have been asking this, guys, will YouTube All-Stars... 3.0 come out now oh boy 
God, everyone knows I created the YouTube All-Star Series, and it's pretty crazy. It was the biggest idea out there at the time, and, you know, no one's been able to come up with anything bigger as far as collaborating-wise. And it's it's a very time-consuming, very, very time-consuming collaboration that I basically have to manage every second of. Uh, so, will it happen again? Yes. Yes, it will. I will do a 3.0 if I can get the guys to do it again, or, you know, maybe we'll try it with, like, a Junior All-Stars. Uh, we'll try with some smaller YouTubers and do like a big group of people, as many as possible. And we'll, we'll see. I have an idea. I have a new idea. It's going to kind of revamp the YouTube All-Stars. We already hit number one in the world, guys. I mean, what else can I really ask for to get 10 YouTubers together, hit number one in the world with the top, be the top clan? I mean, what can I, what can I ask to be besides that? I was leader of the top clan in the world for just a day. It was like 12 hours or whatever, 10 hours. But it was one of the coolest things ever inside the game and something I never thought I'd accomplish. So... I'll have to come up with a new idea for YouTube All-Stars because that was the whole point of the old series. So the new one will have to be something a little more creative and new and, you know, different, a little bit fresh. Got to keep it more fun. But yes, I will come up with a new idea for that. Give it a few months. I'm thinking of summertime to be the release of that. I also want to do a meetup in Chicago this summer. I know White Lightning will be definitely down. I'm hoping to get Cole. I'm hoping to get him. Clash of Comedy out here. I know White and T-Bot will be in my Chicagoland area. So we'll definitely be doing some meetups out here. Uh, so be ready for that. We'll get plenty of warning this time. Last time we gave like a day warning, which is bogus. We're sorry. Uh, but with summer being open, I think we're going to go ahead and make up a, I don't know, we'll probably give you guys like 14 days heads up and we'll shout it out a few times over that time period. But just keep your ears open and be prepared. And if you guys want that to happen, go ahead and comment below and say you do. So that's pretty cool. Other than that, not much else going on. I really do appreciate all your support, guys. I mean, let's see. What else? What else can we talk about? I don't know. What else is, what else is out there? I might cut it here. Why do I call my fans Spartans? Well, good question, guys. Uh, I don't know if everyone's been here for a long time or not, but loyalty is the main thing and being interactive. And as a king or a leader um, or just anybody, really, I think you should be loyal and very friendly to everybody and never you're not above anyone. So loyalty is very key to me. So Spartans were pretty awesome. And I figured, fuck it. Why not? Right. But that's the main reason I did Spartans is my thing. I, it's just something I've been into. I don't know. I just always love action movies. 300 is a great movie. It's a really cool story. It's a real life historical story. Spartans were badass warriors. And I like to think my Clash players are badass warriors. So you guys are Spartans. I don't know, man. That's just how it is. What is my favorite drink? Okay. Well, <laughs> that's interesting. And I'm pretty sure they're referring to alcoholic drink from the way it was said. My favorite alcoholic drink is Captain and Coke, if I'm doing mixed drink, and Don Julio for tequila. So that's my that's my shot of, ch of choice, basically. Uh, yeah, that's that's my favorite drink, guys. Otherwise, I like blue Gatorade or water or pretty much anything, really. If you could have any superhuman ability, what would it be and why? Whew. Well, that's a, that's a fun question, guys. All right. Uh, let's see. You know what? I think if I could be any or have any superhuman ability, sorry, not be any superhuman, uh, let's see here. What would I want? I mean, flying would be pretty cool, but I think teleporting is more efficient. I don't know. I think one of those would be cooler because I could travel the world and do whatever I wanted. And yeah, I think teleporting would be the coolest one, really, because you just go from here to Europe like instantly and just, you know, wherever else, like travel to Cancun or, you know, wherever you want to go, Hawaii. I think that would be the coolest one. But flying would definitely be amazing. Uh, read people's minds would be cool, but I think it'd get really freaking annoying. I think you'd pretty much lose your mind and never trust anybody ever again. Uh, yeah, so I don't think that'd be a fun one to have. Yeah, definitely flight or teleportation. Which one? What do you guys want? Tell me that. Let's be interactive. What do you guys want as a superhuman ability? All right, what else here? Uh, the other part, why? I already explained that, so that's pretty much cool. Well, I think that's it, guys. I answered all the questions. I hope you enjoyed this. I'll do another one soon. I know a lot of people want the face reveal, so I figured I'd do this just to get out of the way. And uh, yeah, so hopefully you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Love you guys. Peace.